Hey, Isaac, do you maybe want to just give me your initial thoughts on to, on today's result? Uh, frustrating. Um, thought we just gave away one. Um, you know, did a terrible job taking taking care of the ball. Um, we had 20 turnovers. Um, just stuff we could control, man. Those games are always tough, you know. Um, I thought I thought we fought pretty hard, but you know, it's it's the little things that we got to do to you know close out those type of games, especially in the postseason. So it's just frustrating. I, I think the the biggest play of this game that people will kind of take away is is uh, your guys' last chance to try to get the game winning basket. Noah Williams driving up the court. I mean, what are your thoughts on really how that whole play went down? Um, man, I thought I thought we did. We had the right idea. Um, trying to get the ball in the rim, um, push it down the throat. You know, they're a team that likes to come and trap. So um, Noah's just being aggressive, man, doing what a player does, man. Um, and you know, and mistakes happen, stuff happens. Got to learn from it. That's all that is. You kind of took it upon yourself to keep uh, keep the Cougs in this game. Uh, uh, maybe the shooting numbers may totally don't uh, resemble that, but leading the team back in the starting lineup. I mean, what were you really trying to do out there to make sure your team still had a chance throughout this one? Every game, man, I just try to do what I can do um, as a, you know, as a leader, as a captain. Try to, um, you know, help my team to a win, you know, try to contribute in every way I can. It's no um, question to ask, go out there and play hard and uh, let the results, you know, flow. And lastly, Isaac, what does this say about for you next year and your career as a Coug? Um, I don't, I don't know if our season's over yet, man. So, um, we just focus on one day at a time, man. And when that time comes and I'll figure that out. Thanks, Isaac. No problem. Uh, Asher Lind, go ahead. Uh, thank you. Um, hey, Isaac, great game, great season. I wanted to ask coach Smith, um, had a minutes restriction on you coming into this game about 10 to 15 minutes or say you obviously played a little more than that. Um, did you think you were going to meet that limits, that minute restriction heading into the game? Or did you kind of tell yourself you're kind of go against that and play as much as you can to help your team out? Yeah, man, um, it's turning time. Um, you know, when it's time to play when it's time to compete at the biggest level. You know, I want to be there as much as I can, regardless if I'm hurt, regardless if I'm, you know, banged up. Um, just want to go do what I can do. And that's that's the only thing as a player you have control of doing. So great. Thank you. No problem. Uh Theo Lawson, go ahead. Hey guys, it was kind of a back and forth game, uh, uh similar to the last one with ASU. Did, did you almost kind of expect it to come down to the final few possessions and really be really be a, a close game all the way through there? Didn't know what, how it was gonna play out. Um we knew what the goal was was come in and take care of the ball and defend. Um, they have good guards and um, they're a team full of guards. I like to pressure you and play fast pace. So we knew we were going to turn the ball over a little bit, but 20 turnovers is entirely too much. Um, so we just didn't do what we could do to control that. So um, it, it came down to that. You know, if we took care of the ball, who knows? 20 turnovers, um, 24 points off turnovers for them. Um, the result could be a lot different. So. Can you just talk about the last two to three weeks and rehabbing and what that process was like for you to, to be able to get back on the court? You, you tried it out against Arizona and weren't able to, to, to really play that much and then had to sit out. What, what was the last uh, the last three weeks like for you uh, trying to get back on the court? It's always tough being hurt, especially at the end of the season. Um, happened last season. And for me, I just wanted to get back out there and play. Um, but, you know, it's important, you know, I, I take care of my body at the same time. So, um you know, it's, it's been tough, but, you know, it's been it's been allowing me to just support my teammates and um, try to be, just, you know, lead in different ways. So um, I'm glad I got to compete with my guys again tonight and we'll see what the future holds for us. Can you talk about what Alonzo Verge did to, to hurt you guys today? And then also the, the job you guys were able to do to, to limit Remy Martin to, uh, I believe, six points on, on two of ten shooting tonight or today. Um, Alonzo's a good player, man. Uh you know, he, he made tough shots today, and he shot it really well. Um, he rebounded well. Shot a really good game. Um, you know, so, you know, players have games like that, you know. But like I said, we just got to do what we can do to control what we can control. So. I'm, not, I'm not sure if I'll have an, another chance to talk to you again before before the, the season's over. When, when, you, when you eventually do kind of make a decision on next year, what, what, what will the process look like for you? Who will you talk to? And how will you kind of go through that process when, when, when you do need to do that? 
Right now, my mind is totally focused on the season. Um, we're, you know, we just got just got done with the Pac-12 tournament. Um, and who knows, you know, like I said, what postseason holds. So I'm, I'm focusing on this right now. And then when, when the time comes, um, I figure out what I'm going to do. Uh, we'll go back. Asher Lynn, go ahead. Thank you. Um, one thing I wanted to ask, um, a lot of the hype around this freshman class with F.A. Deshaun getting big minutes in the last part of the season. Can you kind of describe the growth that you saw in them over the course of the season as one of their go to guys, kind of their captain, you know? Tremendous. And um, I think, it, you know, it happened different different ways for them. You know, F.A. came out right away firing and he showed you guys, you know, what he could do. Um, and then he, you know, he hit his freshman wall like like everyone does. Um, but he's bounced, he's bounced back through it and just tried figured out how to keep fighting through that against competition. And Deshaun, you know, started off the other way around. Um, we didn't he didn't play too much in non conference, but then conference came around and he showed he's a big time player, man. And I'm I'm excited to see what those guys can do for the rest of their career. Um, I definitely see you know a, a big impact here and um, professionally. So. I think those guys are special, man. And um, along with all our freshmen, every every single one I think has a really special um, future. 